Okay, we're at 1303 East Curtis Street. And I just want to show you the exterior and all the trees. It's probably between the front and the back. Um, it's great. I love all the trees, but seriously going to have to clean all those out. It's probably going to be about four to 5,000, I would imagine, uh, to get all that cleaned out. Just want to show you the neighborhood. It's an area that's, it's right on the edge of the gentrification. So I think it would actually be a good idea to try to pick this one up. Um, just want to show you. Here's a gate over there. And just everything's growing on top of the house. And I did not see anything for a permit for the roof. This all needs pressure washed. Um, it's got a deck up here. I don't think this is asbestos siding. I'm not sure actually what it is. But oh my gosh, this all needs to be cleaned up. It'd be a really cute house. Windows are older, but honestly, I'd leave them as they are right now. There's front door. This needs to be painted outside and inside. Um, it's got original wood floors in here. Let me give you an overview. Good sized living room. Yeah, a little dining area. I love all the window casings in here. I have to refinish the floors. That's probably a couple thousand to do that. Um, there is a fireplace. Um, don't know if that works or not. I probably would just put something in there where they can't use it. I have not seen any roof leaks in here, but again, I don't, I don't know. You can see all the nice casings around the windows. It looked beautiful. It had crown molding, but that's another cost. <laughs> um, but real wood floors, the closet, and then it's got the hallway here goes to the bath and the other bedroom. And then the electrical panel. Um, it says Power Master. I don't think I've ever heard of that. It doesn't look super old, but we'll look that up and just make sure we don't need anything. It's a missing smoke detector. It's a door that goes into the living room. Let's look at all the cool. It's really got some neat features to it. Again, this floor in here, this needs to be redone. But here's cute um, doors that go to um, some storage, like your linen. Um, the sink needs to be replaced. Um, you can see it's been cracked, so that needs to be replaced. Nice medicine cabinet. I would leave these old lights. They're really cool. In here, um, Again, we're refinishing the floors, but I would leave um, this tile. It actually looks like it's in decent condition. Doesn't look like there's any holes or leaks, but I would just have this refinished. It's about about $400 to have that redone. Missing shower head, that's easy to do. And then of course, paint in here. Um, toilet looks okay. Just the, the sink there. It's got that. And then we'll go into the other bedroom. So this is a two one in the front. The rooms are actually, they're pretty decent. You can see somebody's got a good size bed in here. And then closet in here. The closets are small, but they try to utilize some space. You see they've got some shelving in there, plus the rack how it is in these older homes. Um, need to see underneath. Here's the kitchen. It's gonna give you an overview. Um, I would say update the kitchen. That's one of the things that people like. Um, I'm putting down um, probably five to 6,000 to, to do that. And place the appliances. Um, it's got one of those old ironing boards in there. It's really cute. And they're using it too. And it's got some cabinets. 
I would maybe leave this one over here, um, depending, I mean, it's older. All right, maybe touch those up and then just replace this side and put a new um, fridge over here. And I just want to look under here for plumbing. See if it's got it. Looks like there was newer supply lines back there. That's good. Maybe have room for a dishwasher, maybe, underneath the sink there. And then, in the back door, this goes out to a utility room. Um, it's got the washer dryer hookups out here. Ceiling is horrible. Um, I can't get in there. It looks like a storage closet. Um, here's the hot water heater. I mean, I don't see any leaking or anything here. You have to check that out. But, but yeah, this one. Can't get in there. I'm not sure if it just goes outside or it's storage. But this definitely needs to be painted out here. Also, too, just to show you. Let's see if we can get into that. The, the view from the other side of the kitchen living room and then um, this is the closet here for the AC it does have a nice train unit big industrial size filter and the unit I looked and it's from um, 2005 so it is older um, it looks in really decent condition it's something we'd have to service and then go from there but possibility to, to keep that all right so I'm going to try to go out back